Okay, so hello, this is Captain Cool, and welcome back to another video. Today, I want to be reacting to Carson Wentz's injury. Um, you can see him walking um, off the um, stage there, or the field there. Um, and then Nick Foles is going to come in for Carson Wentz after he tried to dive into the end zone and got a turn ACL. Um, and there's going to be um, some stuff in this video about um, what happened to Carson Wentz at the press conference what Doug Pierce had had, and that's him leaving right there, and that's him talking after the ACL, he, after he knew. Um, so yeah, I will, and this is the Eagles defense held up and he won the game for the Eagles, and yeah, I will see you guys when Doug Peterson starts talking. Alright, good morning, or good afternoon, I should say, 12, yeah. Okay, so yeah, that was just um, Coach Doug Peterson talking about Carson Wentz and his thing, um, his L ACL. He will be out for the season, um, maybe even 9 to 12 months, which is kind of scary for Eagles fans like me. Um, I'll have more reports in a second, not from Doug Peterson, just from me. Eagles quarterback Carson Wentz has suffered the campaign ending injury during Sunday's 43-35 win over the Los Angeles Rams. He was hurt on the third quarter scramble dive into the end zone, but Coach Doug Peterson told reporters he believed the injury occurred just before Carson Wentz was hit on the one. It appears watching the film again today, it was actually before the contact, so it could be a non-contract deal, Peterson said Monday. That, But that's just what happened. It appears like on tape. With Wentz on the shelf, the Eagles now turn to Nick Foles under center. It is a crushing blow to Philadelphia, but Wentz is understudy surrounded by a talented Waster on both sides of the ball. So, yeah, Carson Wentz is going to be out for this season, Eagles fans. Carson Wentz is doing very well. Um, I hope, I will, I hope he is. I know he's in the hospital right now and so. stuff. And okay, now, okay, guys, now you're going to listen to Carson Wentz speak about his injury. What's up, everybody? Um, obviously, it's been a rough, rough day for me, uh, personally. Uh, I'm not going to lie. Um, you know, I have a ton of faith in the, in the Lord and, and in his plan, but at the end of the day, it's still been a tough one. You know, and it will be tough on me for a little bit, but... Um, as I just kind of reflect tonight, uh, I just know, I know the Lord's working through it. You know, I know Jesus has a plan through it. I know he's trying to grow me in something, teach me something, use me somehow, some way. Um, this will just be a great testimony um, as I go forward. You know, maybe not all of you out there are Christians or, or followers of Jesus, um, but I can say with 100% confidence as, as a follower of Jesus. Um, so, yeah, Carson Wentz will be out for a very long time after this. Well, not that long. But Carson Wentz is not coming in for this season, and, and I was I was pl I prayed for Carson Wentz to come back, and I was I'm kind of sad he didn't. But Nick Foles is there, tell the Eagles. Um, do you guys think Nick Foles can run the Eagles' offense and bring us to the Super Bowl, or do you think he's going to bring us downhill and bring us to misery in the playoffs? What do you guys think? I think. I think we can win this. I think he can win this offense. I think he could bring us to not close to the Super Bowl. I don't know. I'm not saying the Super Bowl. That would be really cool. But yeah, I don't know. I'm not really sure. 
And now, because everybody is so desperate that Carson Wentz is out, let's go get Colin Kaepernick! Oh my gosh. It's like people are like, yeah, like we, yeah, be, they're so desperate. I, I, when I heard people saying that, I was like, oh yeah, I, I like almost threw up. Dude, I can't, no, uh, if I, if, if there, if I had a horrible quarterback and I had nothing else, I would never even go to Colin Kaepernick. Like, the thing that he did during the national anthem was really bad. And I, but people are just so desperate these days. I can see why. We were doing so good with Carson Wentz and then, oh, yes, he gets hurt. And now we don't have, we have to rely on Nick Foles to do something for us. Like that guy right there. Um, I think he could do something. I think he could step up. He could show how good he is, if he is good, and bring us to victory and lead us to the Super Bowl. Which I like. He. The thing is, everybody's so mad about Carson Wentz, and we can just get like, and then if we have Nick Foles. I mean, this season might be over for us, but but I mean, Car first of all, Nick Foles has a good offense around him. Second of all, this season might be over for us, but. Oh, you don't wait for like next season is white, like wait in a couple like wait in a year. I didn't say a couple of years. It's white in a year, guys. You, I am. I was really panicked about Carson Wentz being it, but then I realized that it wasn't that bad. That we can still come back, and we can still be the team we are. Amazing playoff hopes, and that, that leads to NFC East. Wide open. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, be ready for more videos like this. Not this bad. I know this video is bad. Um, but I'll make good videos sooner or later. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you guys next time. Ah, oh, kill the pain.